looked impossible. I'm not sure if you knew, but it's the 10 year anniversary of Zenyatta winning the Breeders' Cup Classic right here at Santa Anita. You and mom were there that day, weren't you? I believe so. I mean, I only know it because they, they're plastering it all over, you know, Twitter and, uh, and Instagram. But oh, it's, it's special. Just, it's neat. Did you see her in person when she was in training? Um, never in person. I know um, I've seen her in person at the farm. Remember when we went mm -hmm. back uh, a few years ago? She um, still has that aura about herself. She's like a giant. But John did such an amazing job with her, given being so patient. I don't think she ran as a three-year-old, or she did late. She ran as a, she didn't run as a two-year-old. Her career started when mm -hmm. she was three. Well, I feel like her size, she's still, I mean, so they're still growing, right? But has to be probably the top three all-time best fillies ever, huh? If not the top. To do, to do what she did, and it's interesting to hear Mike Smith talk about her race on when dirt. she lost you have to, say to that, blame. <laughs> Uh, he said that was probably the best race of her career. Still thought she, she was going to get up that day. I did too. It did. It looked like she was going to make that, that run. Trevor Denman thought she was going to get up. Zenyatta on the outside looking at Lucky. Blaine, Zenyatta, Zenyatta, Zenyatta is flying. Blaine trying to hold on. Blaine and Zenyatta. Blaine has won it ahead. As she got it older and older, it seemed like she fell back further and further early on. And she was still able to close. It was remarkable. Yeah, I think they clocked her like 45 miles an hour. Really? really? Yeah, I think somebody had said that. It's crazy fast. And uh, I it, can remember one particular race. I don't remember which one it was, but Mike was trying to come in through the inside. And he literally crossed. I mean, his hoofs had to become so close to that horse behind him, uh, in front of him, actually. But she had such a quick turn of foot. It was almost scary dangerous mm -hmm. because she'd be up on top of a horse so fast. Mm -hmm. Was it her her stride? Oh, of course, it has to be her stride. But she also had um, a quick twitch about her. She mm -hmm. could put it, pick him up and put him down fast. I mean, you can have a big stride, but it could be in slow mo. Exactly. You know, like a camel. Big stride, but quick. Yeah. I mean, she was fast. I mean, she didn't she win from seven eighths to a mile and a quarter? Could you say that a mile and a quarter perhaps was one of her strongest distances? Uh, when she was really good, I, I don't know if anything. I don't know if she could be beat really at any distance. Yeah. When she was on her on her game. Against the girls. And now we're going to try it again one more time, aren't we? So Ever. on the 10 year anniversary, a late is yes. looking to beat the boys. You know what? Wouldn't I, that I, be I, special? I, I kind of might want to root for her. Right? Yeah. I and mean, what a fairy tale ending that would be. This is her swan song. Yeah. Choosing to run against the boys because it's a better distance for her. Uh, that would be pretty special. Is she here yet? Yeah. God, I haven't seen her. She's pretty I'm remarkable looking looking. For him, is she? Yeah. Uh, it's going to be an exciting race. It's going to be exciting two days. Yeah. Always is, right? <laughs>